I took a minor hiatus from pack and play because I was so incredibly frustrated with how EA treated us on those presents. It was unbelievable. It's making me rethink pack and play in general, but I still want to close out this season strong. Here's our current pack and play roster. Every single player on this team has been assembled from a pack or set. We got a beautiful 90 overall offensive line. We got Tony G, Tyree Kill, Jordan Addison, Mac Hollins. We got Justin Herbert, and we're kind of lacking at the halfback position. So if I could pull a really cool halfback, that'd be nice. Defensively, we've got the amazing Gronk, Demario Davis, Kenneth Murray. Kind of need a strong safety. Could definitely use a few more corners. And we could definitely use an awesome D tackle. And that's why today is a perfect day. Eric Armstead and DJ Moore Limiteds are in packs. That Eric Armstead is a menace. But I love DJ Moore. I'm glad he got a card. And there's some pretty cool offers in the store right now. There's the Zero Chill Star Champ Pack. You get 390 pluses and you get a choice of one of two. You either get a 93 or you get a Limited while Limiteds are available. And right now, Limiteds are available. And there's also a Zero Chill Bundle half off. So let's start right here. Best case scenario is Eric Armstead. That's why I got my Niners jersey on today. Boys, I am so excited to go to the Lions' first playoff game. And of course, I'm getting my tickets on SeatGeek, the sponsor of today's video. With over 28 million downloads, SeatGeek is the number one rated ticketing app. And with the NFL, NBA, and NHL in full swing, you definitely don't want to miss out. SeatGeek has your tickets to every game. SeatGeek takes tickets from all around the web and puts them in one location to make sure you're getting a good deal. Each ticket is rated on a scale of 1 to 10, so look for the green dots. Green is good and red is bad. And of course, you know I came through for you guys. Use my code MMG for $20 off tickets at SeatGeek. That's $20 off your first purchase with promo code MMG. Make sure you click the link in the top of the description and download the app. Enjoy the rest of the video. But listen, we might not even need that pack. If they just want to give me a limited and a 90 plus, I'd be cool with that. Start with Uchenna and Wosu. I'm pretty sure he's really good. Yeah, that is a fast linebacker. 89 speed, 89 finesse. I'm not mad about that. Next 90 plus is a ghost of my... Oh, right. Shit. Uh, I forgot that these can be 90s. Darn it. I saw the animation. I thought it was something bonkers. Okay, but it's still cool, but can it be something better? We do already have Demario Davis too, unfortunate. All right, boys, this is the moment of truth. We're either going to see the 93 overall animation, which is one of the two you just saw, or we see the Tokyo Drift fucking highway patrol, and that's the limited. Let me see it. Let me see it. Shit! Wait, could be a halfback though? That's actually kind of nasty. That would be a, that'd be a nice upgrade on the O-line. Peter Skaronsky is not a bad pick, but that's not what I want. I want a mother... Ooh, Roquan gets me horny too, but just not what I was going for. Gosh, this Gronk is so good that there's no way I can take Roquan Smith. We're beefing up the offensive line with Peter Skaronsky. What are you looking like, Skaronsky? What do you have on you? Jeez, he's a monster. All right, we get Peter Skaronsky, no limited, tough L. This is the final release of Zero Chill, boys. This is the last time we're gonna see Zero Chill. I'm gonna go with the Zero Chill Fantasy Bundle because this also has the choice of one of three 93 overalls or a limited while available. This is my last look at Zero Chill. It's kind of sad. So upcoming, we'll have the Easter promo and obviously we'll have playoffs and Super Bowl before that. So I think those will be really fun to see. I'm kind of praying that Nick Bosa gets one in those because obviously the Niners made the playoffs, but I don't know. Maybe that's really a lost cause. These Zero Chill Fantasy Packs are dog water. And this is also kind of why I've been rethinking pack and play a little bit. Packs have been so bad. The Zero Chill Odds Unlimited's got so much worse after Tyree Kill and Fred Warner. And those presents left a really, really sour taste in my mouth. Oh, shit! See how they do that? Do you see how they do that? They're listening to me, bro. They're like the government. They're listening to me. They know I'm talking shit, so they give me the best... The fucking six foot six strong safety. Oh my God, they know. The six foot seven strong safety, my bad. And you know what I said? I said I need a strong safety because I have Justin Reed in right now and we get, oh, they hear me. They knew I was going to quit, so they suck me back in. It's like an addiction. We even get the goat Jake Browning. All right, so every time I open a pack, I just have to say, EA, I'm quitting. EA, I'm done. EA, I'm never opening a pack ever again. <sighs> they know I'm lying. They know I'm a fucking fraud. All right, we get 390 pluses and then a chance at the limiteds once again. But we already got a massive upgrade to this team with that Julius Peppers. Start with Josh Downs. And of course, with all the 90 overalls that we pull, we can go over to sets and take our choice of a player. And I feel like there's a 93 overall halfback. I'm just trying to think of who it is. Maybe there isn't. All right, boys. I need to see Tokyo Drift. Come on, baby. 
Come on, baby. No. Not that. We don't want that. We definitely don't want that because I already have Will Anderson on this team. Second one is shit. Don't do me like this. No. No limited? Ooh, I didn't even know Hutch had a card. I like that. I think I'm gonna go Hutch here. Although Roquan's a nice upgrade. Let's look real quick. Let's look real quick. So my current left end is Will Anderson. Oh, but then my right end is AJ Epinesa. So let's move Aiden Hutchinson to my right end. That's gonna be nice. Damn, no limited. They don't love me like that. It's okay. We got some huge upgrades today and I can sort by program zero chill and we should be able to complete one of these sets. Oh, we totally can. So we could complete the set for AJ Brown, Jesse Bates, Joe Burrow, Micah is a nasty option. He would be really, really good on this team. I don't think we need Mike Will. We got Hutch. Do I put Okoye as my halfback? Do I pick up the Nigerian Nightmare and put him my halfback? Tariq Willen is crazy good. And I do need corners. There's no true halfback. Dude, I'm about to do this. Can I like view the item? Christian Okoye, 93 overall. He's 6'1", 250 with 90 speed, 92 carry, 94 trucking. I want him. I'm gonna redeem 93 overall Christian Okoye. 93 overall fullback Christian Okoye. Actually, I can redeem another 90 overall right now. So we're still pretty close to picking up another 93 overall. All right, I removed the extras from the lineup and we have enough for one more 93. This Tariq Woolen is one of the best corners in the game. I have to go with Tariq Woolen. So 93 overall Tariq Woolen. Not only does he have 94 speed, man, and zone coverage and press coverage, but he's six foot four. He's gigantic. He changes direction fast. I love it. I just love this streak. Well, it's so good. All right. So here's the new look team on offense. Christian Koye is a 93, but he's actually a 94 at halfback. So he's even better. I don't know what abilities he gets. So let's find out. His discounted abilities are goal line back and matchup nightmare. Jeez. Better route running and catching versus linebackers. I might go with that. I'm going to do that. I'm going to go matchup nightmare so we can give him routes out of the backfield. I think he'll just kind of truck through people anyway because he's such a beast. So well, I'll just give him Freight Train, Matchup Nightmare, call it a day. Also, Peter Skaronski, I assume he gets nice abilities. Gets post up for one AP. I'm gonna rock that. So now our offensive abilities are post up on Skaronski. We've got five on Justin Herbert for Gift Wrapped, Hot Route Master, Gunslinger, zero AP on Jordan Addison, and one AP for Matchup Nightmare, Freight Train on Okoye. That is seven of seven. Defensively, we gotta make some adjustments for sure, because we got a ton of new players. Let's start with Julius Peppers. He gets Lurk artist for zero. Yeah, I think I could go with that. Tariq Woolen will get pick artist for one AP. Also going to give him universal coverage. CB1 is Martin Emerson. CB2 is Tariq Woolen. CB3 is Julius Brents. I'm going to put no outsiders on Will Anderson. Damn, we're a 92 overall now with a 92 offense and a 91 defense. My abilities on defense now are Gronk with Avalanche Lurk Artist. We got pick artist, Lurk Artist, Lurk Artist. No outsiders, deep in zone KO and pick artist, inside stuff, lurk artist. Damn. Yeah, lurk artist is a very good ability if you can't tell. We've added Uchenna and Wosu, Julius Peppers, Tariq Woolen, Aiden Hutchinson, Christian Okoye, Peter Skaronsky. Six upgrades today. And we didn't pull a limited. So it was a damn good episode. Herbert Gronk Addison against Gronk Reek Randy. Damn. All right, let's play ball. First and 10, boys. What do we got here? I kind of... Is that open? Damn. Eh, it wasn't too far off. But that's that Tariq Woolen, actually. Tariq Woolen is just as fast as Tyreek. All right, second and 10. Ooh. Look who frees up. Jordan Addison. Beautiful play. Go first and 10 here. Let's hand off to Okoye. Let's see if we can punch this up the middle. He has Avalanche Gronk, though. I gotta be a little scared of that. But doesn't matter when Okoye does that. Nice work. I can't be juking with Okoye. I gotta truck people. I mean, we got the numbers. That wasn't an avalanche hit stick, thank God. Otherwise, I would have been in a lot of trouble right there. Does he expect to run one more time? Just gonna check this down, see if we can make something happen in the open field, and we can. Five yards. I'm gonna rock a little PA crossers here. See if the play action gets him. Ooh. Right down the middle, Matt Collins, give me a block. Oh, nice play, nice play, nice play. The play action actually got him to bite right there. See if I can get him again. Two for two. Little freeform pass to Tony G. Nice freeform right there. That was money to get him upfield. Now we can actually run this. Hand it off right up the middle. Might as well go for two if you're if we're that hot, right? I'm look for Tony G. He's not there. Uh-oh. I'm just gonna throw something. 
Damn it. Oh no, I'm not gonna get converted on, am I? I am. Pride cometh before the fall. I was so geeked about my awesome drive that I go for two. Might as well onside kick it, right? The feds can't stop me. Ooh. Randy Moss has got some mitts. They did nerf onside kicks. They're nowhere near as powerful as they used to be, but you know, I just felt like getting goofy. He knows about the avalanche. Somehow I did not get it there. That was kind of unfortunate, but hey, it's a really good stop regardless. This is an RPO. I've literally seen this a thousand times. Oh, it's not. I lied. I've seen nothing a thousand times because that was not an RPO. That was a nice ball. That's the RPO, but that's a great tackle from Kobe Turner, making it second and seven. Another run, another RPO. You gotta do something about those RPOs, man. RPOs are so stupid. He's struggling with PA crossers because he keeps biting on the run. Didn't really bite there, but he just didn't have it covered. Tony G is gonna go for a good amount of yards here. It's gonna be a high scoring affair. Gonna do it again. Play action this time. Hold those bucks. Barely got the ball off. Thank you, thank you. Coming out in the same thing, but I'm actually going to run this one up the middle. Great blocks. We're at, we got a good run game right now. Third and three. Third and three. Got Tony G on the edge. Nice work. First quarter's in the books. The score is six to nine. I love that. Shit. I forgot that that's got Lurk Artist on it. I thought I could throw it over his head. Don't let Gronk get two on me. No way, he's faster than Tyreek. I thought I could throw that over his head, but no, no, no. I'm here to tell you right now, we don't care. Let me tell you, right, let me tell you <laughs> we don't care. Oh my God, I almost went all the way. You just gotta believe, gentlemen. It's that simple. Believe that you can win and you can win. I imagine he goes and covers that now. Good to, oh my God, Okoye! You're actually fucking kidding me. After those immaculate two plays, after running through Gronk, he fumbles. Alrighty, boys. Just goes hand off Derrick Henry. This is an RPO, but... Oh, it's not. He did this before, actually. Oh, can I get there? Damn. I thought I could get there with Julius Peppers. He ran that before. Was this one an RPO? What was this? He ran this before. Second and 10. Beautiful. Sacked third and 15. Okay, he at least broke that up. Probably should have picked it. He's going to go for a field goal here. That's actually really good for us. That's a 13-point game, so really not that much different from a 10-point game. Do you believe in the 6-19 to comeback? I believe. I believe! I believe! Jordan Addison, what are you doing? Dude's going insane. Great catch, Jordan Addison. Okoye, that's why you give a matchup nightmare for that catch right there. I'm gonna go inside zone, just punch this up the middle. And he fought that to third and inches. Not bad. Didn't think that would even go through. All right, third and inches. Gonna step up with Herbert. Got a ton of room. Slide this down to first and goal, and let's chew a little bit of clock here. I don't want him to have infinite time left when he gets this. And he knows I'm running it, but I'm gonna do it anyway just to get a little bit more clock off. I'm gonna snap it at two since he expects the snap at one. There's second and goal. And it looks like he's just gonna let the clock go, which I'm shocked by. I think he does get ball at half though, so this is gonna be, this will be a tough game to win. Tyree kill, hit trout, beauty. All right, 12 to 19. Yeah, we take the PAT, make this a six point. You gotta just believe, boys. Believing is all you need. He's got 14 seconds and two timeouts to make something happen. It's technically possible. So he's ran this a few times, and every time he's ran it, he's thrown it to Tyreek Hill. So I'm just going to go manually guard it, see what he throws. So he goes underneath to Diggs here. He's tackled in bounds. Or no, tackled out of bounds. Four seconds left. He has to get the touchdown here. I'm just going to drop back to Tyreek. He's going to go... That's pretty open. But if I intercept it, which I did, he'll lose momentum. So that's really good. You gotta love how many blockers were there and they all ignored the only guy who could tackle me. Alrighty. 
Just got to kick off again, but that was nice to pull momentum. So he no longer has a bar of momentum. 13 to 19. I don't remember what he did out of this last time. Is this the throw to Tyreek? Oh, no. He's got him on the left side if he wants it. He's going to step up. He's going to throw past the line of scrimmage, which, where does that put him? Second and 15. Good defense. I'm going to try a blitz. Got him! Let's go! Can we actually win this game? I gotta go cover Tyreek's corner route if this is a corner. No. So he's coming across. He's got a post that isn't open. That isn't open. And that's... Oh my god! Wait, Julius Prince! Whoa! Whoa! And he's still up! I thought I had it with Tariq Woolen. I didn't mean to showboat there. Oh my god, this is actually winnable. It was a horrible ball. Okoye, too easy. Oh my god. That's a one-point lead. Do you believe? Oh my god, could I get a 40 bomb on four-minute quarters? Could this be the game for the 40 bomb on four-minute quarters? First and ten. He checks low to Derrick Henry. He's only completed five passes the whole game. That's kind of crazy. Nice ball to Stefan Diggs. I got to take a good angle with Peppers or I won't be able to catch him. Barely. Stopped him at the four. All right. At least we got an option to stop him now. I kind of expect a run here. Let's bring Whit. Yes. Oh, absolutely blown up by Kobe Turner. If not, Winfield was there too. I shot that gap. Second and goal. Now he passes for sure, right? After that? Yes. Nice ball. He gets the touchdown quick. This is going to be a fucking slug out. Ooh, was this an RPO last time? Hands it off to Derrick Henry, bottled up. Kobe Turner's playing out of his mind. Two massive stops from him, and now it's 25 to 20. Not sure what he's looking at. I can't outrun that Woolen. That Tariq Woolen's too fast. He calls a timeout. He didn't like my no huddle. Okay, well, if you're going to switch to this, then I'm going to run the ball right up the middle. Mm. Second and eight. I'm going to do it again because he doesn't expect it. Yep. It was just so unsuccessful last time that you know he thinks I'm switching to a pass. Beautiful. Tony G, stay in, buddy. Stay in. Darn it. I wanted to get a little rack yards out of that, but that's okay. Still a really nice pickup, really nice play. Switched it a lot. I think this is man coverage. Tony G is so open. I don't even know what that coverage is, but he's dropping back deep. You see when his players go up like that? He's going for the strip fumble on every tackle, but it's also why I'm breaking a good amount of tackles. First and goal, gonna start out here with a run to Okoye. That's the end of the third quarter. I'm calling a bunch of fake audibles here just to run inside zone. Yep. Oh my God, that actually worked. Damn. I didn't think he'd be able to blow that up. Third and goal, huge play. Going for it. Go. Oh. We gotta go for it. I'm gonna go QB sneak. Let's see how close we are. Wish me luck, boys. Tush. Push in! We do need this two-point conversion, though. This puts me up by a field goal. Oh, he's out of position. This should go. <sighs> Maybe I just cut that up and jump. I don't know. But a lead is a lead. We're up by one. Gotta go low on this tackle. Beautiful. Julius Bryant's having a great game. Okay, so I covered that check down. Whoa! Quite the move there from Diggs. It worked, though. First and 10. I'm interested to see how he does this. Like, does he try and, like, milk the clock and then score? If he is, it'd be a run play right now. No. Okay, so he checks back down to Derrick Henry. Second and two. I'm going to go into a cover two drop. If he tries to throw that again, he's going to get picked off. He's going to let this go two minute warning. Yeah, he's going to hand this off. Okay. Sacked! Andrew Luck goes down third and 12. He saw Derrick Henry wide open. I hope he tries to throw it. Because I'm all over it. I think he threw it. It's 4th and 12 from the 39. Gun bunch offset. It's the same thing. Oh, shit. Okay, but that's actually what we needed. We needed him to get a shit ton of yards. Go in the end zone. That's fine. He's not even guaranteed the touchdown now. I didn't expect to get torched like that, but that's okay. I'm run committing middle. Timeout. I don't think he stays in QB sneak because I don't think he'll get it. Not if I go goal line. I think I can stuff this. Yup. Yup, third and goal. <laughs> he's not going to get it. He's from the two now. He has to switch this. He has to switch up what he's doing. Um, I'm going to go dollar. Does he hand this off? No. Oh, no, I knew it. It was the same throw and I knew it. And I went over two and I'm late, but okay. Hey, 
This is perfect. This is what we wanted. I have 53 seconds in a timeout. He can't outright win the game. See, look, I'm trying to get over there with Gronk. I'm just a little behind it. He does really need this. Damn, that was a very nice play. 26 to 33, so I could score and go for two and try and win it outright, or I could score, kick a PAT, go to overtime. One timeout, 50 seconds left. This is one of the highest scoring games I've ever played, especially in recent time, dude. I've been playing a lot of slow defense games. Let's see what we got here. Money. Jordan Addison's got double me. Shit, audible took for fucking ever. I'm gonna go Koye over the middle here. Please don't fumble. I'm gonna use my one time out. That audible took way too long. It was so annoying. All right. Got him. What a ball. You need to get up there and spike the fucking ball! Oh my god, my second fumble just ended the fucking game! At that down and distance, it's a 12 second runoff. And my second fucking fumble. Dude, I actually played a really damn good game. I just lost two fucking fumbles. Twice, he got free possessions off of that. 17 for 20, 270. He's 12 for 17, 266. That is so fucking bailed out. Well, here's the thing, here's the thing. If that play is normal, Tyreek Hill just gets tackled and goes down, I get one more play. So there's no guarantee I get in the end zone. So I can't be, I can't be crazy mad, but he has zero fumbles. I have one fumble Okoye and now one fumble. Takes away what was a great play right there too. That's so unfortunate. Hey, GG's, awesome game. All right, boys, hey, I love you guys. Lots of fun additions to the team and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out, boys.